Hey guys, oh my god, I'm vlogging. This is so weird. I love vlogs, they're my favorite thing to watch on YouTube, so I'm so excited to start vlogging for you guys. I think you get to know the person a little bit better, and it's not as like perfect as a sit down video. So I'm so excited for you guys to kind of follow me along on my little vlogs. I'm gonna switch it up a little bit, I'll have my makeup videos, and then I'll have my more vloggy videos, which are still gonna be like makeup related. I'm gonna take you along with me, whatever I may be doing or if I've anything to show you guys in a more casual way we'll do it on the vlogs so I'm really excited for this I just got my new camera so I'm literally like ah like I just cannot wait to get into it so yeah it is Thursday today and I have an event later on in Derry with Makeup Pro Store so Makeup Pro Store is basically the shop I used to work in in Belfast they have three stores in the north of Ireland so I'm going to their new store in Derry that they're just opening tonight and I'm really excited about it so I can't wait to see everyone and I really need to hurry up and get this face beat and this hair done and kind of sort my life out I put on some tan last night so I'm a nice little color this is is the Be Bold Extra Dark Tan and Mousse. So yeah, I have that on from last night and I put a little bit on my face. I never really do put tan on my face, but I decided to put it on just because I was feeling under the weather. So yeah, I'm just in my little youtube -y office room. I'm just gonna casually show you it because I am moving to another room soon. So I may as well just show you my little setup so far. Nothing crazy, but I'll just show you kind of briefly and then we'll do an actual little tour when I get my other room done. So let's have a little look. Okay, so this is the room. So it is all set up ready for filming. I want to show you my whole kind of filming area because I have just got some new equipment and stuff and I'm really excited. So I'm gonna show you what's going on around here. So this is my setup right here. This is totally behind the scenes guys but I really love seeing what goes on behind the scenes of YouTube so I hope this helps anyone that is interested in even starting a YouTube channel or just kind of wants to see what the hell goes down because it's pretty complicated as you can see. So basically I have my two box lights. So these are from Amazon. I got them along with, sorry my window is open. It is absolutely roasting in here, especially with these lights. So these are from Amazon and I also got like a backdrop, kind of like a big stand to hold, you know, a backdrop. Um, which I haven't really used yet. I just kind of like my white background as it is. So this is the brand right here, I'm thinking. But if you get any box light on Amazon, they're great. So I think these were like 60 pound. I'm not 100% sure, but they're really affordable. Then I have my Glamcor, which I've had for a while now. And it is like my favorite thing that I've ever bought in my whole entire life, bar my cameras. But this is just the best thing ever. It's so portable. I take this everywhere with me and I mean everywhere. If I'm going to a hotel, this packs up so neatly and I just take it out because we never have good lighting when we are away anywhere. So this just saves my ass for everything. I have it placed really, really awkwardly because I have my lights kind of angled to where I want them for me. And then I always kind of move this mirror around just to kind of suit where I'm sitting so I can see myself a little bit further back. Then I have, well, I'll show you my makeup after. So then I have my camera, which is the Canon 80D. I love this camera, but as you can see, it is very, very big. So it's great for filming and sit down videos, but it's not very portable. So that is why I had to get my little vlogging camera, which I love. Then we have this, which is my favorite thing ever. And I haven't actually used it yet. I just got it. So I actually got a HDMI lead for my camera to connect to the TV, which puts everything on a big screen. Like, what the hell, this is so cool. I haven't used it yet, I just got it, but I'm so excited about it. So instead of seeing the little small screen up here, I'm just seeing myself down here and it's a lot easier for me to see if there's anything going wrong because there is nothing worse than filming a full video and then you go upload it onto your laptop and you've got like a bristle from a brush on your face or there's just something not right or like the camera's not in the right angle and yeah, this is gonna stop that from happening, that's for sure and I'm so excited about this. I think this is so cool. Like, I literally feel like Desi Perkins. I got this off her 
I've seen that she, like a lot of big YouTubers, have their TV on the side and I was like, that is genius because you really can see what's going on. So. I had to do that also. You can connect it to your laptop or whatever you want, but we had an extra little TV here, so I just connected it to it and it can just sit there. So, really cool. So I'm all buzz about that. Like, I just, I'm so excited. I'm such a loser. But yeah, so that is basically it. I have this little mirror, which is from Ikea, and it's really, really handy for doing my makeup even if I'm not filming and then I have my makeup I always set everything out to perfection so that my mind is clear and I'm not kind of working with a cluttery mess which kind of makes me go insane I feel like I'm more creative when I'm organized so I have everything sitting out here I actually don't have a lot I normally have a lot more sitting out when I'm filming because I just don't know where it'll take me but today I think I'm gonna go for something not too crazy and I'm kind of raging because I really wanted to go mad with the Stacey Marie palette but today I feel like I need to go something a little bit more kind of tame but still dramatic for going to this event so yeah this is in front of me when I'm filming. I'm gonna show you what is behind me now. Okay, so now we're going around to this area. By the way, that's a little ring light over there. So I tend to use that if the lighting isn't cooperating with me. Sometimes at nighttime, it mightn't be as bright as I want. This bulb also, I'm not sure what you call it, but I'll write it down below in the description box. But this, I feel like really, really helps my whole room be extra bright, especially with the white walls. I think if you have white walls and a really bright light, I also don't have any curtains on my windows because I want all the light to come in. So I feel like that all helps with the lighting when you're filming. I film a lot at nighttime though, so it really doesn't matter. So yeah, this is my backdrop. Well, not really a backdrop. I'm just gonna move that. This is where I set up my little decor for my backdrop. I'm gonna come around here and show you exactly what it looks like so yeah that is it right there it's so weird to see behind the scenes of someone's setup look at the amount of makeup on this disgusting so yeah that is what is going on right there and this is where I sit that little oh my god okay so my heart is broke my heart is broke why would this happen? I literally, I don't even know what I just done. I moved something and I mean my camera. I am lucky that it did not smash into shit, but the TV did and I'm really fucking upset about it. <laughs> Why would this happen to me when I'm trying to film? Like, oh my God, I was like sitting showing you my new setup and like how excited I was and that happens. Like, what the hell? Oh, so annoying. Anyway. That's, I have another TV so I can just connect it, but why like, why would this happen? How sad. Okay, so I went and got a new TV. My HDMI lead and everything's working. I thought it was broke because it had pulled and it bent a little bit and I wanted to cry, but it is working. Thank God, this TV is actually better. This is just an old TV that I've used, so like, a cool idea if you are filming and you have an old TV lying around, just get a little HDMI lead for your camera. I got this on Amazon, just wrote in Canon HDMI leads and it just connects to your TV and so handy. So yeah, back to the tour because my heart just went crazy right there. I was about to just give up on everything and just never vlog again after that, but let's go back into it. Then we have a little setup right here, all the office admin work and then here I am looking hot AF. <laughs> this is the reality of filming. I literally have sweatpants on, fluffy socks, sliders and a top that I'm gonna wear to make it look like I have my shit together when really this is what it looks like. But yeah this is the little setup right here. All like my admin stuff and kind of emails. So yeah that is that little area and yeah this is just a little mirror from Ikea and my setup so this side sorry if you can hear squeaking because these floors are hella squeaky but over here we have my Depop area which is just a real solely 
for me to get rid of clothes so I decided to make a depop just so I can sell some of the stuff because I literally have bought so much clothes and I need to get rid of so many of them because I don't really wear a lot of things over and over again especially statement pieces so I just feel like it's such a waste of nice clothes when I buy them and wear them once and then they sit in my wardrobe. So I feel like you guys would appreciate buying things for cheaper even when they're still in the shop. So I am going to just constantly update my Depop. I haven't even put anything on it just yet but I have loads of stuff down here that I'm going to sell as well and I have a lot of really nice expensive dresses that I'm gonna sell for a lot more cheap so if you're going to a wedding or anything and you're around my size then that could be a really good option for you so yeah stay tuned for my Depop so I'm gonna go get ready and hopefully I'll be right back looking a hell of a lot better okay so makeup is kind of done so i went for something colorful i didn't think i would but i did so thank god for that i thought i was going to go for another brown smoky eye and i would have died if i did so i used the Sissy marie palette i'm obsessed with it i can't wait to create more creative looks with it but this is kind of the look i went for right now i kind of ruined my lid with my lashes but I really just can't be bothered fixing it. So hopefully it's not that noticeable, but yeah, so I really should turn off the laptop two seconds. I love listening to YouTube when I'm doing my makeup. It's so like relaxing for me. It's like my favorite thing to do. So that explains why Shane Dawson is on my laptop. So I'm gonna finish off getting ready. I just wanted to set up my camera and let you guys see the whole process of taking selfies because I haven't taken any yet. So this is gonna be funny. So hopefully I got a decent selfie out of the 500 that I just took but I am going to just finish off getting ready and I will be back with you in a little sec and we'll head off to Derry to the event. So just before I go this is my little outfit. These little jeans are like three quarter lengths and they are from Topshop. They're so comfy and they're just really pretty. They dress up anything. Then I have this little yellow top. This is actually from New Look. It's my sister's, I stole it. And then this little necklace is from Pretty Little Thing and my shoes are semi shoes and I wear them literally all the time. They go with everything. So that is me ready to rock and I will see you soon. Here it is, the new makeup pro store. Dairy. This is in foil side, so really, really handy. And oh my god, I'm so excited! Hi, I'm Tina. I'm here. <laughs> I'm here with my old workmate. You were both. You were Dairy. You were Belfast. You were Dairy. So I'll link them down below, and you can go check out their social media and. <gasps> I'm with Tina, sure, and my hands, look, I have scrubbed these. I have went through three bottles of surgicals. I can't get off. I'm cutting a ribbon tomorrow, like Shrek. I can't. <laughs> Look how pretty the store is. Like I'm I wanna work here again. Like it is so gorgeous. That is my work. I did that myself. So props to me. This is such a cute wee area. Back with my baby. I miss you so much. I know, we need an ice 
Because I've been working so hard all day. Now help me get the brushes. <laughs> Normally I have a thinner one than this, but this is really nice. But I like that one. Because even with my pigments and stuff, I've started using more fluffy brushes rather than flat brushes. Me too, it goes like a little more. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. I love this brush. It's got a bigger version now, but I love it for like even on the right concealer. No one will beat the number four. You got it? You're about to have it. No. Love that. For right, like I'll take problem. that. Actually, do you know what? I'll get a red lip. Do you want red velvet or yeah. you Americana? Oh, which one do you like? Red velvet? Okay. Red velvet is a good one. Amazing. Amazing. You're quite a kid. You're neither one. Yeah, I am. Do you like their stuff? Yeah, I love it. I've never tried their stuff. Love it. What about you? Hi, Jamila. Um, actually, give me epic. A wee epic. Wow, wow, wow. That's a love it. Better. Look at this gorgeous boy. I miss him so much. Your hair is unreal. I love it. Look who I'm here with, John and Joanne. Hi. I miss everyone so much. Like I'm just like, this is so weird. I want to come back and work here. It has to happen right now. Hire me. <laughs> I look very rough right now, but I'm just home and I had say hello to Bear, my little baby. Don't they say your dog looks like your owner? My friends say that he looks like me because he has blonde hair and brown eyes. Just like me. Just like your big sister. I'm not his mom, I'm his sister. Right? So yeah, I just came back there and I'm so tired. It's like really late and I have to set up for tomorrow because I'm working really, really early in the morning. But I had such a ball at the Makeup Pro event. It was so, so good. So nice to see everyone. Yeah, it was just so lovely to see some of the girls that I actually, are you okay? Yeah, I hadn't seen some of the girls in literally like years since we both worked in makeup pro stores. So it was so lovely to see them. Everyone's from all over the place. So it's not that often that we all see each other. And it was just like a little reunion. So it was so nice. Can you please stop? And it's always so good to see Patty and Joanne and Anita and Elaine and all the management and everyone that runs Makeup Pro Store. It's just like such a family. I literally miss it so much. I miss working there so much, especially today when I seen Patty doing like body painting and stuff. I just want to get like stuck into it. I'm going to be involved with Makeup Pro Store anyway in the next coming weeks. Me and Patty and some of the girls that don't work there anymore have arranged some little things so I'm really excited for that and to get back into like a nice team of creators it's kind of hard sometimes when you work by yourself and you work for yourself you kind of get into your own little world and it's always good to vibe off other artists and kind of get some inspiration off them as well so I'm really excited about that so yeah the pro store gave us a 50 pound voucher each which was so generous and um, we were able to go around the store and buy whatever we wanted so I bought a few little bits and bobs so I'll go through them tomorrow with you because I'm so so tired so yeah I'm gonna go take off what's left of this makeup and go to bed and I will see you in the morning hey guys so it's the next day it's evening time I didn't see the point in vlogging this morning because all I've done is work on admin work so I just thought I'd pop on now and show you my little outfit that I'm wearing right now so yeah this is my top this is like a gorgeous little sweater it has a little zip here and it has the logo right here then we have my little three-quarter length trackies these are elasticated and they are so comfy and then I have my cute little sliders which say naked on them I love this little outfit it's given me airport vibes and I'm definitely gonna wear this a lot it's so comfy I also got this cute little bucket hat with the logo on it I'm obsessed with bucket hats I think they are so cool so I can't wait to wear this see so yeah, you guys Naked is one of my favorite websites for clothes. I'm obsessed with their swimwear. So if you do want to go 
go and check out their website, make sure and use my discount code, which is CIR20 at the checkout for 20% off. Guys, honestly, I literally live for their swimmer. So yeah, I actually wanted to show you some of the little bits that I got in Makeup Pro Store last night. So I actually didn't get that much. I just got four things. I had done a big massive shop the week before so I didn't really need anything I bought so much the week before so basically I had forgot to get my brush soap last week so I went ahead and got myself the Barbara Holman I think it's called this is my favorite brush soap ever it literally cleans your brushes so well it makes them look brand new then I got the makeup pro store number four this is kind of like a blusher brush it's like a small kind of blusher brush this will be gorgeous for contour and blush even putting on foundation I absolutely love these kind of brushes I actually had two of these before but they went missing my sisters probably stole them so I got a new one so the next thing I got was one of the liquid lipsticks by Lime Crime this one's called Red Velvet and I absolutely love this this is one of my most used red lipsticks I've literally rebought this so many times so this is a really really good one and it's like a staple red to have in your kit so there is a little swatch of the red velvet it's like a real true red and I love it then I got one of my absolute favorite highlighters this is epic by Illamasqua this highlighter is so beautiful on it's got like a gorgeous champagne undertone to it so this is beautiful on your face and also on your body it's so so nice so yeah guys while I'm sitting on the ground playing with makeup I'm gonna actually finish this vlog I edited a good bit of the vlog last night and I have loads of footage so I think I'm gonna start off with daily vlogs because I feel like they're really fun and quick and I also can edit them really quick which I love because I'm normally taking like two or three days to edit one video so I really hope you enjoyed my first vlog let me know of any suggestions that you want me to do for my next videos whether it be makeup whether it be a vlog whatever you want to see I'm gonna do and if you do want to see anything in particular maybe me take you makeup shopping or maybe like more of like a makeup day kind of like doing clients and stuff or even just me kind of preparing my kit things like that like I really want to show you behind the scenes of being a makeup artist because believe me it's not all glam so I hope you enjoyed the video guys and I will see you very soon bye